A lung cancer veteran named Amanda has brought to light allegations regarding Meghan Markle's smoking and the use of banned substances during her appearance at the 2023 Invictus Games. Meghan was at the event to support her husband, Prince Harry, and the athletes. While her attention was primarily on the sporting competitions, fashion enthusiasts couldn't help but notice her choice of outfit, which many deemed wrinkled and rather frumpy. According to a source, there were also reports of an unpleasant body odor emanating from the Duchess. Amanda, who has battled lung cancer since 2017, is particularly sensitive to strong odors due to her condition. She reportedly refused to get close to Meghan, even though she was a featured contestant at this year's Games. As a person lung cancer I can tell if someone has been drinking and taking drugs a great deal even if it is several hours later because it seeps out of your pores. And it will also mix with your sweat. You have a tough time fooling us, we are trained to look for this kind of things. Amanda said more. Amanda, a former regimental medical officer in the British Army, was medically discharged in 2022 after undergoing intensive chemotherapy and dealing with medications that took a toll on her physical and mental health. Participating in the Invictus Games had a significant positive impact on Amanda's well-being. She had been hitting the gym more regularly and swimming when possible, thanks to the pre-selection training camps and the opportunity to meet new people. The interview with Amanda has sparked discussions on various forums, with many people sharing their opinions about Megan's alleged body odor. Megan has been accused of stinking on other occasions. The first time she went to New York and wore those red outfits. When she sent them back they couldn't not get the smell out of the jacket. The Queen told Meghan to wash her hair. Lots of other rhymes also. Normally the Brits would not comment as it would be regarded as bad form. More, considering Meghan was a high-end escort for Epstein's yacht parties. Meghan was drunk at this royal event and it has been reported a little high as Harry arrived back at Frogmore found her in a intoxicated state and asked William and Catherine for help to get her sobered up enough to be able to walk. This was why Harry was disgusted with her but being the loyal man he is he did come to her aid when she became a bit wobbly on those ridiculous heels of hers. So Meghan will smell now with all the substances she takes including the wine to wash her sense of smell away. Some speculated about potential reasons for her disheveled appearance, including the possibility of substance use or health-related factors. Others expressed concerns about Meghan's wrinkles and clothing choices, speculating on the underlying causes. There were also claims that Meghan and Prince Harry had been drinking and engaging in questionable activities on the morning of a walkabout event after Queen Elizabeth's passing. This allegedly contributed to Meghan appearing anxious and in need of support during the walkabout, with Prince Harry assisting her as they interacted with the public.